The pandemic's impact on students has been difficult over this past year. Taking virtual classes, even canceling some like band. 41 Action News reporter Nick Starling introduces us to one man helping kids hit a high note in the Shawnee Mission School District. Fifth graders couldn't start band this year due to COVID. So to prevent them from falling behind in the sixth grade, one band center owner brought what's called band test kits directly to the parents here at a tennis court. This is not your typical band practice spaced out playing on a tennis court, but it's the first time many of these Shawnee Mission School District fifth graders have tried one of these instruments. I never played the saxophone in my life. This is my first time playing it, but I've heard it before and I just really like the sound of it. This year started off on the wrong note for these students passionate about music, but having their beginning band classes canceled due to the pandemic. Well, I wanted to be in the band this year, but I can't until like sixth grade. Parents figuring out how to fill that void. We need to keep him busy. You keep kids busy, they don't have a chance to misbehave. So that's where Mike Corrigan comes in. And they call me the horn doctor. He founded BAC Musical Instruments and has a son in fifth grade and didn't want kids like his son to fall flat when entering sixth grade band and thought to bring these kids together to help them continue their love for music. Why wait? Let's just, we have a whole summer. Everyone's been boxed up in their house for a couple of years. It seems like an eternity now. And I thought this would be a really healthy option for kids emotionally with their their psychological, you know, well-being and stuff. They're using these band test kits containing a rubber mouthpiece, right, well, which helps the student choose which instrument is best for them. It's really great because it allows a young person like this to really explore themselves and realize that they can create something remarkable. Helping the music live on, inspiring these kids to continue their dreams of performing music. And music is very important to me, uh, and I, I can see the impact it has on so many different people. It's going to be really fun. Reporting in Overland Park, Nick Starling, 41 Action News.